You know, Florida has some of the most beautiful beaches in the U.S., but a segment of our population has really a hard time reaching the sand. And that's changing now thanks to a private foundation. Their caring act is what's right with Tampa Bay. One of Melissa Caulfield's favorite things to do is to go to the beach with her family. I, I love it. I, I, I love the beach. It's so cool. But Melissa has a hard time getting out to the water. She has cerebral palsy and is confined to a wheelchair. You can't take a wheelchair on the beach. So uh, we haven't been able to enjoy it as much as we'd like to. Thanks to the Forward Foundation, getting to the beach has just gotten a little bit easier for Melissa. They're providing Moby Bats to any beach community for free. It means independence. It means freedom like I've never had before. The mats are non-slip wheelchair beach access mats that create handicapped accessible paths so that people can get out to the water. We've installed 10 mats throughout Pinellas and Pasco counties. We've got three more in the works that are being installed this spring in Pinellas County and two that are going through the permitting process now, Honeymoon Island. So when all is said and done, we'll have brought 15 mobility mats to area beaches. Ashley Morales works for a huge grassroots organization that connects people with disabilities to social events and activities. She says one in four adults have some form of disability. That's a lot of people in our community and a lot of visitors who did not have equal access to the beach before. Now, just like the rest of their family, they can get out, enjoy our world-class beaches, and know that this is a welcoming community. You got sand on you. Access that Melissa and her family will now enjoy. I'm just grateful that I can um, come out to the beach and be on the sand. Providing some much needed independence and some renewed enjoyments for those with disabilities. It is it really is so simple. It's amazing it took somebody this long to figure it out. But they just put their latest mat there at Sand Key Park in Clearwater. That one is the longest one. But they're expensive. It costs about $23,000. So we need more for sure. If you'd like to learn more about Moby Mats, go to fox13news.com. Click on the We Live Here tab. You'll see that first. And then there's a link to the What's Right session that is just underneath that. Well, you'd love to see those mats at every beach, as many as possible. Uh, because you hear Melissa say it means freedom. Everything. Everybody deserves it. And that's that. such a such a delicate part of our habitat around here that we yeah. all love to enjoy that they all should be able to enjoy too. Absolutely. So, yeah. Yeah.